Hi, my name is Matyas Smodish. I'm a power forward of CSK Moscow. I think the key to our success so far has been uh, team chemistry and you know playing for each other. Uh, and uh, I think that's the only way we can repeat or try to repeat what we, ha what we have done so far. So for the newcomer, I think it's the most important thing to to try to uh, fit in, uh, but not so much playing as. Uh, is trying to fit in as a person, to find his own space in the locker room, and uh, and of course we we veteran players try to do our best to make him feel as comfortable as possible. After years and years with Coach Messina, uh, it's clear to not just me but uh, all the other veterans on the team that uh, basically we have the responsibility of leadership on the court. So uh, it is up to us to make the newcomers understand and uh, lead them in a situation uh, which they're faced with the first time. And uh, it's also our job to be part-time coach coaches at uh, different points in the game or different situations in the season. Well, I think that the most important thing is to be healthy. The second most important thing is to have that team chemistry, to have that uh, union inside the team that, you know, in a, in a tough moment, uh, people don't turn their backs on each other, but, you know, stand together and, uh, you know, try to face uh, the, the troubles ahead. And um, that is something that comes with years, uh, I would say, of practicing, of staying together and of basically uh, willingness to sacrifice one for the other. And when you have that, all you need is a little bit of luck. But on the other hand, if you work hard all season, luck will come. In modern basketball, it is very important to post the ball every time you can, because that way you make the defense work inside and outside. You make them move and you open the floor for the outside players. It's just, I think, the, the mentality that coach has, mentality that this team has, that you have to share the ball and, you know, uh, immediately try to see what the defense will do in a situation like that. The strength inside me that makes me want to you know, show to myself, to everybody, that in key moments I won't back down. I will try to do everything I can for my team to win. If that means scoring a basket or you know, stealing a ball, getting a rebound and uh, I will do that, and by you know uh, showing that to your teammates, uh, I think it gives them confidence. Even sometimes, maybe just being happy for a basket and one or for a three-pointer scored by your teammate means a lot. Showing that energy on the court, uh, and of course, you know, just the basic fact of wanting to win a game. Uh, well, the, the memories are nice. Uh, because it was my first season abroad out of Slovenia and, you know, uh, I think I was at the right time, at the right place and I was lucky to be a part of this great team and uh, uh, basically it was the moment when my career started going up and uh, because every time you win, you grow as a person and you grow as a player. And for me to be a part of a team like Kinder was in that time was, you know, like, uh, I mean, it's difficult to, to, to explain. For me, it was an experience that I will never forget. And, uh, you know, uh, seeing uh, and feeling how Antoine Rigado plays, uh, how Manu Ginobili plays, being there with Jaric, being there with Abio, the veterans, has helped me a lot, not just that season, but also every other season. To be honest, I would say that I'm living the dream right now because uh, I don't think that there is anything better from what I have right now, you know, to be, to have healthy children, healthy family and to be playing for a giant like CSKA is in Europe, to be at the best of my game, the best of my years. And, you know, I'm just trying to enjoy it, even though it's getting harder every year. But, you know, just being a part of an organization like this and being able to 
involve my family in that, in all the travels, in all the <clears throat> experience. It's basically a, a living dream. Uh, I'm fortunate that I have the wife uh, that I have because, you know, she, she also sacrificed a lot uh, for me to, to be able to succeed to this level that I have. And on the other hand, all the, let's say, spare time that I get, which is very little, I try to spend with them. Uh, with the kids and my wife, so they are basically the other uh, force, the other strength in my life. And you know, when uh, things get hard, or when it's hard to go to practice, uh, and, you know, hard to sacrifice some more, uh, a father would think of their kids. You know, and the more the kids, the more the sacrifice, the more strength I have. So uh, it's basically at the end for them, you know, to. <clears throat> Me playing well is also showing them uh, what to do or how to prepare for life after. And uh, I think that when they see me doing the things that I do, they will have a good sense of what it takes to success, to be successful in life, not in just basketball, but all other things. So uh, I'm very proud of my family and uh, you know, that's it. You don't stop.